Hey guys, so this is the Razor Carbon Lux scooter. So I'm just gonna do a basic review and I'll just tell you like, you know, how it holds up and just things about it and stuff, like if you wanna get it. So this costed about, I think 80 bucks. I got it June or July, 2021. And uh, I got it because my Razor A5 Lux broke down. And I mean, it's a Razor scooter, so it's not gonna have the best quality. Like, I would still prefer my Pro Scooter or my Electric Scooters over it, because it's just a basic scooter. I mean, it's good for what it is, honestly. It has adjustable handlebar height, has big tires, so that you can't, like, flip over, over small cracks and bumps, like, cracks like that and stuff, like, on sidewalks. And, yeah, I honestly do like the tire size, because Pro Scooters like that one have really small tires, which cause you to almost flip over whenever you're going over bumps and stuff but on the manual it says not to do jumps and tricks and stuff or just like ride on slopes but just do it and like if you want to you can do it and it's not gonna have any issues i'm not sure why it says that because i can do jumps wheelies manuals 180 jumps just basically anything and it's not gonna mess up so yeah it's just your basic scooter overall and if you want something for your kid or just for you to ride if you know, you can't afford anything better and you just want to do some tricks or just riding around or something, then it's a good thing for you. And it's not very expensive either. And it has decent ground clearance, which is about, I think, two or three inches, probably closer to three. You know, decent standing deck. It's pretty wide and pretty long, so this is my foot compared to it. You can fit both feet on it this way or, you know, any other way that you want. And it has a kickstand, which I like because most scooters don't have that. I mean, comparing it to my pro scooter, I mean, my pro scooter doesn't have it and this one does, which is pretty cool. And that's pretty much all I have to say. I mean, it also has this braking system. So like, instead of having to, you know, step on the ground to slow yourself down, you can just step on this and then it'll stop. So yeah, good scooter overall. That's all I have to say and make sure to sound.